What is up guys, this is Doc RJ from Animal Gamers and I'm bringing you some footage of the tutorial part of Dreadnought. This is currently in closed beta, so let's get it started. Everything looks interesting. I haven't tried playing any um, ship based combat games in a while. I mean, I know there are a World of Tanks, uh, warships, and such, but I've never played it. So, right stick. Looks like it's for looking around. And this is right stick, left stick is for navigation. Okay, so looks good. Okay. So how do we go up and down? So R1 is to go up L1 is going down so we have to go up or else we'll hit that so swipe up on the touchpad to amplify thrusters Target. So R2 shoot. So reloading. Okay, so it doesn't mean one shot and then reload. You can fire multiple times. It's 20 shots. One, two, three. Swipe down to touch pad to turn off weapons. Okay, so it's swipe down. Huh, kind of weird. I'm swiping down, but. Do that again, I did it. 
Let's run through our defensive systems. Huh. Activate the anti-missile laser now. Unless you want to pay for the next paint job. I'm getting impatient, Captain. Not bad. Defense systems are crucial in any That's... battle, Captain. Huh. Interesting. Excellent. Now, take the module systems offline and divert energy to the shields. gonna get some time to get used to. Good. Uh, I think uh, let's get into a game of multiplayer just to check out if we actually learned anything from the tutorial and see what this whole game is all about. Let's 
take a look. So this is the dashboard. This is the dashboard. So we play the tutorial mission. All right. Right now, this is our. Okay, this is our character right now. Um, we only have the default. I think it's just most of it is just default with some shaders I guess okay so let's go to hangar so right now we have a set of four different uh, ships artillery cruiser is basically a giant cannon with engines nailed to the back She's designed to decimate targets of the A well-placed shot from the main gun can cripple an enemy. A lot of moving parts means not a lot of armor. So she's not going to hold up for long at close ranges. Keep a weather eye out for aggressive maneuvers from the fire. Alright, so... This is like your heavy... <coughs> ship. Oh wait. So that's your heavy ship. Uh, this I think this is the. But when it comes to the destroyer class, average means shut the hell up or I'll blow a hole in you. Her armor can soak up plenty of damage and enough firepower to dish it right back out again. Plus, she's got enough in the way of maneuverability to get you out of just about any tight spot you might find yourself in. So this is like your average uh, battleship with okay guns, okay maneuverability, while this one is a heavy gunner but slow to maneuver. Okay, so let's check out. So that the first one was the Augusta, Rurik is the, this one's the Rurik which is a heavy hitter. And then the Cerberus. Okay. So this is like our healer ship. Attack cruiser's main weapon is a directed energy beam. It was reverse engineered through transhuman technology so it could be used to either repair allies or fry enemies. Attack cruisers tend to get targeted first. My advice, stick close to the heavier ships and keep them supported while they take the front of the enemy attack. Okay, so this is your basic healer type of ship. Let's check out the uh, Simargil. There she is. Dreadnought class. Oh, okay. So this is the Dreadnought. She's lined from bow to stern with heavy armor. Your, to the gun with fire so this is your tank, basically. The Dreadnought size makes her a pretty easy target on the battlefield. Watch your positioning and always keep one eye on the smaller, faster ships. Especially anything with long range fire. Okay, they think. Oh, so we can customize uh, our arsenal. We can rename it. Um, let's try if we can edit the loadout. Sydney Bay battleships come equipped with primary and secondary direct damage outputs. Each okay. ship's chassis is built around its primary weapon, so it cannot be exchanged. In other words, your ship is a giant space gun, and everything else is pretty much an optional extra. Okay, so. Your secondary weapon can be exchanged for more damage. Right. So we have repeater guns. Oh, so we have to upgrade these first before we can use it. So I think that's the only thing we have for now because we don't have these, I guess. Yeah. Uh huh. So. Last one. Ships come with four different modules and standard. Primary, secondary, internal, perimeter. Alright. Your ship's secondary module <clears throat> complements your primary, adding another layer to your combat style. So these are your basic um, uh, abilities, I'm guessing. So it's. 
the one that is hot keyed into your um, input controller, your triangle, square, circle, and X. Okay, so let's go back. Tech trees is this is I'm guessing how you uh, eventually unlock all these other um, battleships, if you may. And this one is. Oh, so these are different ships, while these on the left are your manufacturers, I'm guessing. So Jupiter Arms, this one, and Oberon. So I guess uh, we have to unlock it one at a time as we progress through the game eventually. So... Uh, maybe we should just... Uh, I wonder how we can jump into a game. Alright, so... Okay. No, let's... Oh, what? Okay, so this is a training match. So the other one was a tutorial. This is the training for the actual combat aspects, I'm guessing. wonder what type of ship I'll be using. Looks like I'll be using the average um, battleship. So, oh wait, I get to choose. So yeah, I'll, I want to use the uh, Augusta since it's the most. Man uh, I mean, it's easily maneuverable. I uh, adequate firepower. I don't think. Um, I can start using a dreadnought class as of yet, so alright. It's ready up. <coughs> so right now we're on repeater turrets. Oh crap. Whoa. Almost hit the building. Okay, where are we supposed to go? Thrusters are online. We're going up. Solid lock. There they are. Full thrusters. We're going in. Targeting. Oh wow, a dreadnought. Shield activated. Going down. Okay. Let's maneuver around them. Missiles locked on target. Shield activated. Wow. Okay. Launching torpedoes. He's almost down. Captain, we've got a lock. All right. Let's take them from the side. Full thrusters. We're going missiles. Whoa! Okay. Oh crap. All 
Alright, full thrusters, we're going after that. Okay. It's I think it's cloaked. Yeah, we got this. Where, we're getting hit. Where where is that coming from? Dreadnought, full power. Whoa. Bring it down. Torpedo launched. Torpedo lock confirmed. Missiles away. All silos reloading. Captain, don't think so, Captain. Missiles still reloading. All the guns fired up. Enemy warheads locked on our position. One less dread activated. Alright, we got uh, the shields up. And let's get out of here. Got a reload. Torpedo lock. Oh, there are some more over there. We have to regroup. Shield activated. We're locked on, Captain. Power to maneuvering thrusters. Okay. Alright. Get our health up. Missile silos not yet online, Captain. And it's down. Whoa, 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 whoa. Gotta get out of here. Fire, fire. We're getting we're gonna try to maneuver behind them. Dreadnought eliminated. Nice. Take out the support ship first. Reloading autogons. Full power to maneuvering thrusters. Where is that ship? Oh crap. Enemy missiles incoming, Captain. Solid rocket. It's not looking good out there, Captain. The enemy's catching up. Alright, we got our retreat. These are shield for now. Oh wow. We've got torpedo lock, Captain. Let him loose. I launch torpedoes. Reloading missile silos. Yep. Shield activated. Oh no. They got our support. We gotta take him down. Reloading some reboot complete. Launching torpedoes. We're right under him. He's down. Take out the support. Scratch it's down. Get the other one. Power 
We have one more over here. Locked on the target. Lost, give us time to reload the torpedo tube. Torpedo away. Missiles reloading, Captain. Crap, what's hitting me? What's hitting me? Oh, and we're under a snow. New. No. Oh. Oh, so we can respawn. I thought it was just one life. Anyway, so let's go. Shields. Take him down. Oh. Uh, okay. So that sucks, but <laughs> it was fun while it lasted. So. I think we'll stop it from here on uh, I'll try to get more videos in um, gameplay in our next playthrough or trial of this closed beta and hopefully this types of crashes doesn't happen again all right so thank you guys for watching and I'll see you next time bye